Today, Kim Ventrella is coming to visit us. She's the author of Skeleton Tree. We're really excited to have her. She used to work in Fairfax County Libraries. We're excited to welcome her back here today. I loved working at Fairfax County. Definitely my work in libraries informed a lot of what I do, and it was really great to just get that connection to literature and really get a great feel for what, what motivates kids to read and what type of stories are they looking for. If you do want to get into writing. Well, in my writing, I always like to look at that intersection between darkness and whimsy. So when you're writing for middle grade, you can really talk about some difficult topics, but you always have to have a sense of hope and you want to bring in that idea of like, kids are just now discovering the world and they're able to tackle those difficult topics, but you want to do it in a way that they can relate to and understand and are going to be comfortable with. So I do tend to talk about some tough issues, but there's always a lot of fun and adventure and I involve fantasy in all of my stories too. So skeleton Tree is about a skeleton that grows up out of the ground and only children can see him. Um, and it does get into some difficult topics, but I think that kids always like enjoy going along on the adventure too with the main character and it's not just all about the issues, it's also about entertainment and having fun reading. I love visiting schools and talking with students who just, they love to read and they're also interested in telling their own stories and it's so fun when they send me back thank you videos or thank you letters and tell me about how I really motivated them to become authors themselves. That's really, really fun. So there's a special program called Kids Need Mentors on Twitter where they pair authors with classrooms in different states. So we're sharing videos and they're sharing their writing with me and I'm giving them feedback. I have a lot of fun stuff coming up. October is a big month, of course, because I tend to write spooky stories. So I do October 13th. I'm doing a webinar just all on writing spooky stories. So that's open to everyone. It's through the Society of Children's Book Writers and Illustrators, which is a great group. And in February, my second book, Bone Hollow, will be released. It deals with similar themes and just has a, that similar feel of like the whimsy and the spookiness mixing together. So if you like Skeleton Tree, then for sure pick up Bone Hollow. It's going to be right on the same note, but with different characters. So look me up and you can follow me. Um, sometimes I'll do funny videos, writing tips, all kinds of stuff. You can find me online. It's kimventrella.com. Go to Twitter, Instagram. I'm just at kimventrella. We have a lot of events throughout the county, and you're welcome to go online to our website. To